Hello. Uh, today is our last week of looking at people rising up in the Gospel of Mark. We've been seeking to understand how the, the call to rise up in our daily life is sown throughout the Gospel. Part of what's implied in this uh, whole approach we've been taking is that words have echoes throughout the book of Scripture, and indeed that they echo um, broader themes from the whole scriptural witness. So today, we'll be telling the story of a, a young boy who's been robbed of his voice by a mute spirit, uh, whose life has been threatened as the spirit seeks to throw him into water and fire. And Jesus comes, grasps the boy, and raises him up. And I want you to note that I'm trying to remind people, visually, the whole point of this series, that the death and resurrection of Jesus is related to the little deaths that we experience in daily life and the little resurrections, the ordinary resurrections that God brings when he lifts us up. So let's listen to the story. As Jesus was coming down the mountain, he saw a huge crowd gathered together with the disciples. And they were arguing with the legal experts. When they saw Jesus, they were astonished and they ran to him. They were greeting him. Jesus said to them, what were you discussing with them? And someone from the crowd stepped forward and said, teacher, my child has, has, a, has a mute spirit, and often it, it takes hold of him and it throws him down and thrashes him about and foams at the mouth and stiffens up. I asked your disciples to drive it out, but they weren't strong enough. Jesus said, oh, oh, generation without trust. How long am I to be with you? How long am I to put up with you? Bring him to me. And they brought the boy to Jesus. And when the unclean spirit saw him, it, it threw him down, thrashed him about. He stiffened up and was foaming at the mouth. Jesus said to the father, how long has it, has it been happening like this to him? He said, oh, since childhood and often it has, it has thrown him into water or fire in order to destroy him. But if you're strong enough, have compassion on us and help us. Jesus said, if you're strong enough, everything is possible for the one who trusts courageously. The father screams and said, I trust. Oh, help my lack of trust. And seeing that the crowd was coming together, Jesus said, to the unclean spirit, mute and deaf spirit, I order you to get out of him and never enter him again. The unclean spirit, convulsing the boy, came out of him. And he was so, so corpse-like. People were saying, oh, he died. Jesus grasped him up and he rose. I hope that this Easter season has indeed been a time of resurrection in your life. And I pray the blessings of the God who raised Jesus Christ from the dead by the power of the Holy Spirit upon you. Thanks.